Hi, Lou Mosca, Chief Operating Officer of American Management Services, and welcome. How are you, Straight Talk audience? I hope everything's going well for you today. And one of the things I've been wanting to chat with you about for a long time is consultant phobia, I call it. So 100 years ago, before I joined American Management, the thought of joining a management consulting firm had never crossed my mind. And I did it because I was at a crossroads in my life and I thought I would do it for six months, then move on. And as some of you know that follow me, I've been doing this for over 25 years now. And I have to tell you at this stage of my life, I still get jacked up every day to come in here and try and make a difference in people's lives, our owners' lives, okay, our clients' lives. It makes a difference to me. So what's a consultant, you might ask? And why do so many owners have this, oh my God, voodoo, image of consultants. Well, I googled this morning what's the definition of a consultant and it's an expert in a specific topic. That ain't me, dude. Um, That's not us. We're not experts in what you do. We're pretty good, maybe experts, in helping you do what you do better than how you do it. So let me give you an example. I've never run a manufacturing environment. I've never run a manufacturer never owned a manufacturing business. I've never been a contractor, never built anything other than my family and the business. So how am I going to tell you that one bricklayer is better than another or one machine operator is better than another? It's just nonsense. And if if someone comes in and tells you that, it's poppycock. How's that? Bull- so here's what I think. You know your business. You're the owner. You intuitively know your business. But there are statistics that say almost 50% of independent business owners struggle week in, week out with several topics. Cash flow, profitability, margin control, people. Of course, everybody wants to grow sales. But if you don't have that foundation right, cash flow, margin control, profitability, people. Okay. If you don't have that foundation right, what are you growing on top of? Growth for the sake of growth is not going to help anything. So what do we do as a consulting firm, as American management? We believe it's our job to help cultivate, teach, mentor your good people to have great opportunity to help you move the ship forward faster. So if you've been stuck at about $3 million a year in revenue for the last three or four years, and you know you should be in $5 million, we'll help you push that needle faster. If you know your gross profit's 22%, and it really needs to be at 26%, we're going to help you get there faster. We're going to help teach it, guide it, push it, put our size 10s up, everybody's you know what to get you there. So my definition of consultant, with a facilitator to get you where you need to be quicker, for you and your family. And yes, sometimes we take a bum rap and sometimes maybe we don't do the best job in the world. But if the consultant you choose to work with, if you're man enough or strong enough to do so, doesn't stand by what they do, then it's your fault. You hired the wrong person. Sorry, it's your fault. You hired the wrong person. If you want to see somebody stand by what they do at our cost, if necessary, then you know who to talk to, okay? So consultants should not be afraid of them like you should not be afraid of your doctor, your lawyer, or your CPA. Just shouldn't be. Because if you hire the right one, you'll get the right result. I hope this helped clarify what consultants do or should do and how we do things, okay? If you want to chat with me, um, hit me up on LinkedIn, lewismoska at amserve.com. Like, share, subscribe if you like these videos. And I'd always love to talk to you, 800-743-0410. Here's to the consulting community.